Hello everyone. In this video, we're going to simplify a factorial expression or an expression with factorials. We have 13 factorial plus 12 factorial divided by 13 factorial minus 12 factorial. What is 13 factorial? What is n factorial? Well, n factorial is basically a product. You start with n and then you just keep going down until you reach 1. So, 4 factorial would be 4 times 3 times 2 times 1, which is equal to 24. But wait a minute, are you serious? Like 13 factorial is such a large number, think about it. You're going to multiply 13, 12, 11, so on and so forth, all the way down to 1. Even 5 factorial is 120, and 6 factorial is 720. 7 factorial is 5040, they grow really quickly. So 13 factorial is such a large number that we shouldn't really evaluate. And what is the point, right? I mean, a calculator can do it, but we're going to take a smarter approach. And here's how it goes. When you expand any factorial and start with the bigger one, which is 13, you realize 13 factorial is 13 times 12 times 11 times 10. And you can continue all the way down to 3 to 1. But wait a minute. Isn't this part another factorial? Yes, it is 12 factorial. So 13 factorial can be written as 13 times 12 factorial. Factorials have this interesting property. So now we can write 13 factorial as 13 times 12 factorial and 12 factorial as 1 times 12 factorial because that's what it is. And again, the same thing. And now 12 factorial is a common factor. So why don't we just factor it out? And when we do, we're going to get something like this. Look, 12 factorial on the outside, you're going to get 13 plus 1. And here, wait a minute. Yes, okay. And here, you're going to get 12 factorial times 13 minus 1. Beautiful. 12 factorial cancels out. 13 plus 1 is equal to 14. 13 minus 1 is equal to 12. And you can simplify this. The final answer is just going to be 7 over 6. And that's it. Bye-bye.